Hello friends, welcome to Take My My YouTube channel. In this video, we will see about regular expressions. Let's get into the video. So normally, regular expression is used to find a string or a pattern. So I have a pattern. I want to find a similar thing which is available in a uh, file or list or set. So uh, I wanted to find a similar thing. Okay, our data commonly we can say I have this data. I wanted to find a similar pattern or I want to find this exact string what I have. For this reason, only we use regular expressions. So where it is used means you can sort out contact number. You can get a particular contact number. You can search for contact number in a file so this all i'm going to explain you with examples okay so to use regular expression you have to import r e module import r e okay here is the first example r e dot sub so this is the format okay r e stands for regular expression dot sub r is uh, raw string okay so a b i'm uh, giving this in bracket a b and then asterisk and then input data okay so what it says means listen carefully this is my input data whatever i'm giving the data directly here and asterisk so and a comma b it will replace wherever a b is there with asterisk in my input data wherever a b is available it will be replaced by asterisk okay so it is starting from a got replaced by asterisk and then c d e again a is there got replaced by asterisk such a way wherever a and b is there it got replaced so this is the purpose of using bracket and a b okay so it's for used for one letter replacing replace one one letter one one letter wherever whatever we are giving in this uh, parameter it will replace it with everything okay so here is the next example i have given print ra dot sub i have not used the bracket here a c i have given same i wanted to replace with asterisk so if it is a c it's coming together means then it will replace else it won't replace when you use bracket it will replace the individual letters also but when it is uh, not coming uh, in bracket see if ac is there ac got replaced by asterisk so you can find a here c here separately separately if it is separate then it won't replace this is the purpose of with, uh, using without bracket print re dot sub or whatever the string you wanted to find from the data what you have and what you wanted to replace it with okay this is the common format just remember don't get confused and then third example print re uh, dot sub i wanted to replace with number here i'm using with string i want to check with number the same thing wherever one two is there it will be replaced with asterisk so one two is there only in three places so it got replaced and then you can give a range i have input data i wanted to replace from a to d means a b c d till a b c d every letter will be replaced see if you see this you can find only e because a b c d e for all uh, until d everything is gone so you are getting the only e values okay this is how you can uh, use regular expression this is a basic example we have more in-depth examples moving forward and next one using uh, letters as well as numbers which means a to b two to four both should match both conditions should match and this is my input data a1 a2 a3 a4 so only two two four which means two three four a2 a3 a4 so this condition matched and when you check a comma b at least a is there in 2 3 4 right so only this three elements will be replaced with asterisk if you see here a1 is there a2 a3 a4 gone a5 a6 is there so now meta character same thing you have to use uh, re meta character means this dollar symbol uh, asterisk star sorry in both are same time asterisk star and then at the rate this, so this all comes under meta character here i will show you same thing i'm using h dot y which means h is a starting value and then dot it will take one value in between and then y is the ending value so that is how it will check okay so i have a string uh, here hey hi how hey so it will replace wherever h dot y it finds it will replace it with and so it uh, it is matching with hey because starting as h ending is y and then dot means any uh, value it will consider any string it will consider letter okay we can say so here it is not matching here it is not matching here it is matching okay I am giving one more example h h y have given h y h y y so where and all it will match first it will match y because starting is h ending is y and h is the uh, intermediate character and h y is just starting with h ending with y so it won't match it will print the same and third one h y y so which means first second as middle y it will take and then h and y it will consider so it will be printed and okay so h y h y so this is how it will work and coming to search so so important uh, concept search is listen carefully this is the pattern for search R E dot search okay regular expression dot search and which pattern I wanted to search and where I wanted to search regular expression what I'm going to do search and this is my pattern this is the input data okay then this is how input data should be so here is the example 
it will help us to find the match and it will search in the input data if the match is found then you have to use group statement to get the uh, uh, outputs so you can take all the values in the group statement then you can print the group statement I have given one small example here match object equal to re dot search same thing i just copy pasted here so if match found this is a match object is the variable name i'm keeping here if match object in case if search worked if some uh, search found something matchable then print match object dot group when you are not using group it won't print especially when it comes to search so you have to use match object dot group i mean group is comma compulsory match object is the reference name i'm giving here else no match found and other thing it will take only the first match if you have 10 matches in your string see earlier if i print it will print first third everything right but here it will take only the first match in the beginning of the string so hey match found this is the output right i hope you are able to understand you can check using dir already told you whatever the available functions for match object okay obj what i created so details equal to open okay i'm creating a file details.txt and i'm writing uh, 10 lines or uh, 12 lines you like this hello my phone number is 9873 like an age i have given so here i will show you this is the uh, file i have created text file with 12 lines okay so this is what uh, the file cons uh, contains i wanted to find first number from the document first number first contact number from the document i have 12 lines i want all the 12 lines means you have to open the file in read mode you know how to open a file so you in, in order to read each and every line what you have to do you have to use for loop so i'm using for loop here for line data as a reference you can use i also so for you to understand i'm using line data for line data here and here i'm performing the regular expression operation so match re dot search percentage d and line data percentage d where it will do line data line data is this line okay so line data it will check in file object file object is details.txt so what is percentage d means it will take only the first number if you have 10 digits okay if you have 10 digits it will count only the first number and you have to call group then it will print so in all the 12 lines what is the first number available it is uh, getting printed here so to get all the numbers i want to get the complete contact number what you have to do here you are using d right percentage d just small modification use d plus d plus means it will check the first first and then second third fourth fifth seven uh, six seven eight nine when space is there then it will break it won't go further so it will print all the continuous number which is present inside the string okay so i'm using d plus here here is the example all the numbers will be printed okay this is the concept and then i have in this file if you see i have now phone number as well as age i want both phone number as well as age in this situation what you have to do uh, the process is very simple instead of using search you have to use find all function find all okay regular expression dot find all when you use find all it will get all the numbers in a list format this is list right so in list format you will get it so the contact number phone uh, age contact number age contact number age you will get it and he see i used match here purpose of match we have seen search and then find all now i'm explaining about match so you have 10 lines of string here in st inside the string you have contact number age contact number age everything you have so when you are using match it what it will do it will check first letter of the string whether it is a integer or number or uh, float it will check first uh, letter of the string okay so when you use percentage d as i told you uh, sorry forward slash d this is to check only integers it will check only integers okay so it won't check for string so i'm using percentage d here line data same thing i copy pasted i'm using match instead of search i'm using match here so no match found no match found no match found no match found okay so if you see the file in one line contact number is present at the beginning okay so since it is checking in the beginning if, uh, in all the 11 lines no match found in one line contact number found and it got printed here so this is how match will work in regular expression so we have seen about search find all and match three different functions in regular expression okay so next one what i'm doing here i have taken file i have created using the file uh, I mean, I created file objects using uh, W plus mode. So now I'm giving the input data directly. Same concept. Instead of opening a file, I'm giving the input data. So D plus, I wanted to find out starting uh, wherever. If it is starting from for integer, then it will print. But it is not starting from integer. So print no match found. I used match concept. If you use search, it will search where contact number is present. It will print. Okay. So when you use find all, it will print for contact number as well as age. 
now i created a error log file so i believe uh, some people are aware of what is error log file error log means um, if you are getting errors this is how it should look like this is error method call instance created value error connection refused debug so this is how error uh, file should look like so i created error file i create uh, using w plus mode file file handling okay so uh, here you can use two different things one is dollar symbol one more this symbol is called as caret symbol okay this is called as caret symbol and dollar symbol so take a line of string if you wanted to find a letter which is matching in the end of the string then you have to use dollar symbol but if you wanted to find a letter which is starting from the string which you are going to give then you have to use the caret symbol okay so for that i have given an example here look at this file object open dot error lock i am opening the file i am i want to read line by line so i have five to six lines match re dot search i'm using caret symbol and error so whichever the line is starting with a word called error then print those lines okay if match found then print those lines see two lines i have connection refused connection refused see two lines i have called connection refused and here i'm using dollar symbol also so for that i have given one more example so starting with debug ending with dollar symbol so uh, uh, sorry ending with error word so i'm using dollar symbol see only one line found starting with debug ending with error word okay so this is how you can work with regular expressions and next concept is in same or uh, regular expression i have a file called emails.txt so inside that i have a uh, four to five email ids okay but what is the email id format so first it should be string then there should be some number zero in between zero to nine then at the rate gmail.com right so this is the email id format so i wanted to find out the formatted emails which is in a, a proper format not a random email ids duplicate email ids i wanted to remove then you can use this concept okay so here is an example i'm opening the file as fo you can use the fo equal to uh, open emails.txt in read mode also the other way of opening i'm showing here and this is the pattern it should look like so it should be small a to z or capital a to a to z it is starting from the email id should start from either uh, small a to z or capital a to z and it should be uh, it should contain one digit for that plus zero to nine and a half given and then at the rate gmail.com this is the format okay so i wanted to use find all when i use find all then only it will check the complete lines okay else if you use search then it will match only with the particular pattern so pattern fo.read and if you run the correct email id see three email ids which is found in a proper order see string number at the rate gmail.com string number at the rate gmail.com string number at the rate gmail.com okay so this is how we can extract correct email id using the regular expression okay and i am giving one more example here here i use plus symbol right now i have a email id without a uh, number i have just kumar at the rate symbol.com so how to print that means you have to use asterisk symbol before the third condition and pattern where you are giving third pattern means after the number okay so for uh, gmail.com it is before for number it is after so if you use this i have added one more email id named as ravi at the rate gmail.com we are here only string at the rate gmail.com is there second condition is not matching but it will print this as well for that you have to use a uh, asterisk okay and last one uh, number matching matching the phone number for that what you have to do i am taking a data this is my data where i am giving a number format 333 three, three digit 2 digit 2 digit 2 digit so if you look at us number this is how it should look like so i am using the find all okay regular expression dot find all forward slash means it indicates it's an integer and in brackets i'm giving 333 three, three, okay so which means uh, three uh, number should be there then space again three number should be there then again hyphen three number should be there so when you wanted to find out a number format then you can use this concept so when you uh, print this it will, you will get two outputs see one is here and the other one is here okay so this is how we can do the number matching and if someone asks why we are using r here it will take as a raw string so sometimes when you are uh, running a python code when you use forward slash n it will go to new line right such a way when you use d the function is different so when you are not when you are using r then it will be considered as a raw string it won't perform any of uh, such kind of actions to avoid this only we are using r symbol here so that's all about regular expressions if you have any doubts please do let me know in the comment section i will reply back to you don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel stay connected thank you bye bye